everyday women, women of all ages, body types, and budgets, look and feel their absolute best. And I appreciate your support and hope for your help on my mission. Hi everyone, I'm Erin Busby with BusbyStyle.com. Thanks so much for watching. What I want to talk about today are over-the-knee boots. They've been around for a few um, winters now and they are still going strong. So I want to talk about how you can wear them. Uh, I'm a huge fan. When I originally bought my black suede over-the-knee boots, I did not think um, necessarily that they would work on someone my height, which I'm 5'4", petite. Um, I thought that with over-the-knee boot, you probably would have to be on the taller side to wear them. But I was pleasantly surprised to find out that, yes, even us shorter ladies can definitely rock the over-the-knee boot look. So I want to show you a few options of how you can wear these. You do have to be real careful when you're um, pairing these boots with a look because the boots are very sexy. So you want to be on the chic, sophisticated side of sexy and not the trashy, trampy, streetwalker side of sexy. So you have to be very careful and walk that fine line. So the looks I'm going to show you today are definitely on the chic, sophisticated side and a good roadmap for you when you are working with your over-the-knee boots. So the first look is very simple, the one that I'm wearing. Essentially just skinny jeans with the boots over the jeans and a printed, very fitted turtleneck. And now I think, you know, often I like to say if you're going to wear something this fitted on the bottom, you should wear something a little more blousey on the top. But because I have the over the knee boot, which actually creates a little volume at the bottom, and then this top is also printed so that it uh, creates volume. I think it works. Um, you could also do just a regular black turtleneck or you could do more of a, a loose blouse if, you, if you're concerned about this area, which I know a lot of us women are, especially you know right here the love handles and stuff and sometimes the, the back fat can be a problem. So this will work perfectly well with a blousey top. What I like about the printed turtleneck is that it looks so great with just a little black coat over it. Just very chic. If you want to create a bit more drama, you can easily swap these dark wash skinny jeans for a lighter wash skinny jean. So you want to try your over the knee boot with a skirt. This is what we're talking about with walking that fine line and being very careful because it can easily skew street walkers. So the key to wearing these boots with a skirt is going to be having a really dark, not so sexy pair of tights on um, with your skirt and your over the knee boot. Now this is all out the window if your over the knee boot is a flat. The ones that I'm wearing is a, is a heel. So if you're wearing a flat over the knee boot, I think you can get away with a little bit more because the fact that it's not a heel makes it a little bit more casual. You want to wear a pencil skirt. I think you can do that too. And here's another little jacket I pulled that I think would look fabulous over the black turtleneck with these over the knee boots. My over the knee boots, by the way, are suede and I like the, uh, the suede for fall winter. I think it looks more luxe and expensive. I think when you are buying over the knee boots, it's very important to buy a pair that is either expensive or looks really expensive because they will be the feature of the outfit. And I would suggest, you know, keeping everything else pretty minimal and quiet and, um, and letting your boots do the talking. It's a really great trend. It's something different uh, that you can work into your regular fall winter wardrobe. It makes you feel really sexy um, without being over the top. It's a nice way for, especially for us women, you know, over, let's see, I'm almost 40. So, you know, for us more mature women to look and feel sexy without showing, you know, a lot of skin 
And oh, uh, one more thing, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate your support and uh, you just click on the red button. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.